Hi, today's question comes from Brian. He looked at my relax formula and wanted to know why I do not use melatonin in my formula. It's a great question because I hear it a lot. Melatonin is a, is a natural substance that the body makes. Uh, you can buy it in supplement form. So it's holistic, quote unquote, and it's really the number one sleep supplement that people are recommended to by their doctors. So his question is very valid. Why wouldn't I put melatonin in my formula and why do I not recommend melatonin for people to take? It's a great question. Here's the reason. Melatonin is a natural hormone that your body should be making on its own. Now, it's critical that you recognize that a hormone, if you take it from an outside source, whether it's melatonin or, for example, testosterone or estrogen, such as in birth control pills, you're going to shut down your own natural production. And by shutting down melatonin's natural production, by taking melatonin, you're not really getting to the root cause of why melatonin would be low in the first place. Now, melatonin is really important to help you fall and stay asleep. So I love melatonin to be at a good level. I just want your body to make it on its own. And the reason why melatonin is not made at sufficient levels is usually due to the fact that your cortisol levels are too high. Cortisol is a stress hormone produced by the adrenal glands, and when it's elevated, it decreases melatonin production. So in my relaxed formula, I put nutrients in there that help lower cortisol levels and help balance the adrenal glands out, allowing your body to make its own melatonin. This way, you're not suppressing your natural production of it. The second thing that might cause melatonin to be low naturally or your own natural production of it is not having the right nutrient cofactors. We need certain nutrients to make melatonin. What do we need? We need zinc, we need B6, and we need magnesium. Those three nutrients I put in my relax formula. In fact, if you go and you look at different sleep formulas, you'll see something called ZMA, and it's zinc, magnesium, and B6. Why this combination is utilized is because those are the cofactors that help make melatonin. So melatonin is very important, but I do not put it in my formula because I prefer to go to the foundation and the root cause of why someone might have sleep issues, which is too high cortisol or not having the proper building blocks that make melatonin in the first place. So it's always important with nutrition to address the root cause of an issue. If you think that your sleep issues are due to the fact that your melatonin is deficient, do not reach for a melatonin supplement. Reach for things that help lower nighttime cortisol, give you the factors or the cofactors to help nourish your body to build the proper amount of melatonin. So that way you not only make your natural melatonin production, you can fall asleep, wake up with a lot more energy, and be much healthier in the end. I hope this helps answer the question why I don't use melatonin, why melatonin production is critical to your health, and why it's important that your body makes it on its own. If you have any further questions, always feel free to reach out. I hope you have an amazing holiday.